Welcome to the Dorito 28 vlog. It is the 25th of December 2011. People, how about it? It's Christmas Day. Some of the new releases on Dorito 28 are a Misfit Season 3 video, which I did to kind of push the Misfit Season 3, as it's my favourite TV show at the moment. If you haven't seen Misfits, Watch it, go out and buy the DVDs, they're worth the money, trust me, Misfits is a great show. I also did a video about Frank Spencer saying ooh Betty, because Wikipedia claimed that Frank never actually said ooh Betty. He definitely did, I made a video about it to tell you exactly where that was, you can find that. And I'm pretty sure he did say it once or twice, other than the one I have shown you. Check it out. There's a poem called Imagine That John, it's something I wrote while talking to the good people on the Muscular Dystrophy Forum. Um, we were talking about the world in general and this is just something I came up with in the, on the spot and decided to just post it as a video. I've made a video that just shows you my website wigglewigglesplat.com, check it out, go and have a look at it, it's got some interesting stuff on it. There's also a video which I'm not actually going to show you a clip of here. Here is just a picture. It is a six beer. It was done at half past six in the morning. We'd been drinking Jack Daniels all night. And Grant said to Dan, spear me. So he speared him and they went over the wheelchair. Check it out. Also, I have done a video that has told people all about when Misfits Season 4 will be available and some of my thoughts on misfits please I have had a few comments on this and I could sit here all day long and talk about misfits I will do a misfits video in a few months um, talking about my thoughts on what might happen next season and what I think about the series so far these are the top 10 videos on Devito 28 this month in at number 10 is Imagine That John. At number 9 we have the 6 spear on the wheelchair. At number 8 is Can You See Dog Abuse. Number 7 is Free Men and a Screwdriver. Number 6 Improve Your Memory Peg System. Number 5 Frank Spencer Did Say Ooh Betty. Wikipedia Got It Wrong. Number 4 is Instant Pain Relief for Toothache. Three is information on smoking and some of the health risks. Number two is the Misfit Season 3 video. And number one is the Misfit Season 4 news video. Now keep watching my videos people. And let's see how this top ten changes next month. Some of the comments I've had this month are quite good. I've had uh, one from a guy called Fantango Rock Z14526. And this was a comment on the dog abuse video. He said, those stupid killers deserve to die, not the dogs, TNT. Well, I totally agree with you there, Fantago Rock, whatever your name is, sorry, geezer. Um, yeah, they do deserve to die. They should not be abusing dogs. And people, it's Christmas, come on. Let's make sure if you get a dog for Christmas, you look after it. You know the old saying. And it's not just about that. We have got to try and raise awareness towards dog abuse. And that is one of the reasons I've done the video. Thank you everyone for comments on that video. And thank you for the support. Keep doing it. Another comment I had was from Queenslander. About the six beer on the wheelchair video. And he says, ha ha ha, fucking get that one into ya. Yep, well, you know Queenslander, we like to do it hardcore around here. And that's the way it goes. Grant got speared right out of his shoes, right over the wheelchair, took a rough bump. Um, check that video out, it's a good one. I had a comment from the Claire JP on my Wiggle Wiggle Splat video about my website. She said, looks good Cole. Thank you Claire, I'm glad you checked it out. And I hope everyone else can check it out. As I said, there's some really interesting stuff on there. Also got a comment from Rudy699 who actually commented on the Misfits Season 4 news video. 
but he said you sound like the bald guy from Face Jacker. Now if you're talking about Terry Tibbs, I can understand a little bit. I sound a bit Australian and that didn't really work. But yeah, I guess me and Terry Tibbs have got quite a similar accent. But if you are talking about George Abaguango, I don't think I sound anything like him. Yeah, that weren't particularly good either. But anyway, I get your point. Now, I'm not a religious man. I don't do Christmas for the religious aspect. And I don't do it for the commercial aspect. Christmas for me is about spending time with your friends, your family, the people you care about, the people that get you through the day. You have to meet your friends and your family, spend time with them, and just generally have a good time around Christmas. I hope everybody here has a very nice Christmas.